Welcome to the strategic exploration video. Let's get started. Maybe you are thinking about making an orange cake. In order to do that, you first need to find an orange cake recipe. You might start your search on the internet. You might even read through a lot of recipes until you find one that you like. Once you've made the cake, you may change the recipe to better suit your tastes if you make it again. The early stages of doing research are very similar to looking for and reading through recipes. You find sources that look related to your research, and then you read through them, just like our friend here did with the cake. These notes will help you to make a better cake, or in this case, a better paper or project. It is important to remember that the time spent reading is not wasted. You may not end up using every recipe or source. In fact, the sources that you read and do not use can be just as important as the ones that you do. Let's start our exploration by going to the library website. First, we are going to visit the databases, then click on Research Starters. Research Starters offers 12 databases to begin your search. We will focus on two, Credo Reference and Opposing Viewpoints in Context. First, we'll look at Credo. Credo Reference is a database of encyclopedias and reference sources that will give you general overview information on your topic. Most of what you read here will be background information that will just help you better understand your topic. Reading broadly in this way allows you to learn words, terms, and phrases to help you research. Next, let's look at opposing viewpoints in context. We are going to use the Browse Issues feature and look for a topic relating to community college. It is helpful to start with these types of more general topics and then get more specific as you explore. This is a topic page. At the top, there is a summary of the topic. Below are different types of sources available on this topic. And below that are previews of some of the sources. There are viewpoints, academic journals, news and magazine articles, infographics, reference information, and more. Let's read the overview and look for words or phrases that are related to our topic. These common terms are called keywords and can be used to find other sources later in our research. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video.